Hey there, baseball fans. It's Ben, and I have today in my possession a 1991 score Series 1 box of baseball cards with my buddy Ryan Sandberg right on the top there. I'm going to take that as a good sign and an omen. Look at those 36 fresh packs of score baseball. So let's rip into these and see what we can find. In this one, I do like this set, even though, you know, it's not the world's greatest set probably by conventional measures, but lots of subsets, lots of cards for sure. And um, the possibility to get something cool like a Mickey Mantle insert. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna pull out a Mickey Mantle insert, right? Right, right in these first few packs. Well, actually the first thing we're gonna do is find Day of Justice. Look at that. Coming off his rookie of the year season. And Mike Benjamin, you look like you're having some troubles there, friend. Might need to take a bathroom break. All right, so the first card was good, and then nothing much after that. Let's keep moving here. As usual, I'm looking for Sean Dunstan, Ryan Sandberg, Mark Grace, as Dave Winfield, or Nolan Ryan, my favorite players to collect personally. And then looking for any stars or Hall of Famers, like Bo Jackson, this. Superstar. And then in general, there's a Kirby bucket. And in general, I always keep my eye out for somebody that I always wonder what happened to them. We can find out what happened to them together. Kim Caminiti. Fisk, take him. Oh wait, so this is Doug Desenzo. Interesting story here. He's an outfielder, but look, this is a picture of him on the mound. He did pitch a few innings now and then. So I'm glad they were able to capture that one. I think it's a pretty cool card when you have an outfielder pitching on that at the end. Joe Carter before he went off to the Blue Jays. Oh, look at that, Brian Sandberg, just like the box showed us. So super happy to add that to my personal collection. Not a new one for me, but also just nice to have. Just Carl Tuffy Rhodes, who would go on to play for the Cubs. As a leadoff hitter. Actually, maybe we should find out what happened to him. What happened to Tuffy Rhodes? I wonder what happened to that guy. I got to see him play when he was with the Iowa Cubs for a bit. Probably right around the time he of that card, right after that card, he moved over to the Cubs and bounced back and forth to AAA in the minors with the Iowa Cubs for a little bit. And we got a duplicate there. Greg Maddox. And Jack Morris. A lot of pitchers today. Two more packs. We're going to pull out that mantle right now. Here it comes. Power of positive thinking. Paul O'Neill. That's worth it. Mark McGuire. Very good. But no Mickey Mantle. That's okay. We'll move on to this last one and see what we can find anyway. Good shot of Jim Leritz. We get a lot of this Mike Benjamin in this session, huh? Almost every pack we've gotten one of those. And another Carl Rhodes. Teddy Higuera from Mexico, we learned recently. Ottaby McDowell doing his best Michael Jackson impression. All right. So, Carl Rhodes here. Tuffy Rhodes, as I knew him, from Cincinnati, Ohio. Let's find out what happened to him. Tuffy Rhodes, there he is. I wasn't making it up. <clears throat> Played six years in the bigs. Oh, that's it? I thought for sure. And then 13 in Japan. Huh. All-time home run leader among foreign-born players. 
464 home runs in Japan. 55 home runs in 2001. That's remarkable. He was, I mean, he was a good hitter, but I didn't think he would have that much power all the time. So, 1990-1995. And heading off in 96 to the Kintetsu Contest, Buffaloes. Otherwise, hit 224, 13 home runs, 44 RBIs. But 464 home runs for Japan, that's crazy. So those few years there with the Cubs, you can see. In Japan, 10-time All-Star. League MVP, seven Best Nine Awards. Wow. <clears throat> Serious approach to baseball, like Holton Tuffy. His career... Oh, there you go. Um, 93 hit an extra inning home run to win the American Association Championship for the Iowa Cubs. That's the year I probably saw him. Three home runs on opening day uh, in 1994. I remember that. Off Dwight Gooden, no less. Hit home runs in his first three at-bats of the season. First player to do that. So, pretty remarkable. And then he goes on to... Play in Japan and just crush it. That's just amazing. Never would have known. Carl Tuffy Rhodes puts up some interesting uh, moments in Major League Baseball history and certainly in my baseball history and then goes on to be a huge slugger in Japan. So good for you Tuffy for toughing it out and finding a way to stay in the game and keep playing ball. Hats off to you and the rest of you. We'll see you next time.